I'm gonna run out of fuel. You're already out of fuel? Mm hmm. I'm not out. Well, I'm starting my truck. I have 19 truck. liters left. Well, so am I. I'm starting my truck. We gotta go back. We gotta bring another trailer <laughs> back here. Another, another so, load of trailers. We're going to do exactly that. Parking yeah. brake is good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go this. ahead and I'm gonna crawl myself to the fuel station. You do that. Yeah. I also have to apologize for being such a massive spin tires noob and, you know, running out of fuel. Oh, yeah. You've never played this game before. Uh, clearly, well, I don't know what I'm doing. So <laughs> We're playing uh, in hardcore mode. I don't think anybody picked that up last time we played. Yeah. Hardcore mode, you use more fuel. Damage yep. is easier to, easier to get. You can't automatically recover to garages. There's a lot of features to hardcore mode that it makes the game a lot more challenging than just in the standard normal mode. So Absolutely. That's why we... Yeah. You can see my damage is at 412 to 600. Let's see if we can uh, repair each other. Uh, do we have any repair points? I don't believe we do. Everybody was telling oh, us have last a spare time we tire. did. Yeah, yeah we have do. a spare tire. We can well, do we it. could repair ourselves. Yep, I'm probably going to do that right now. Okay. We do that. Yeah, I spent 88 repair points. I'm at 338 now. Instead of 426 like I was. All right. Uh, spare wheel. Damage repair. Yes, yes, yes. At least yes. the damage isn't red anymore, so that's good. Yep. And you'll save on fuel. Oh, what? You'll My save truck being repaired? Fuel insurance. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, the yeah, more I'm damage sorry. I'm you just, have. I'm so new to this game. I just... Oh, you know what? I didn't... I have no oh, that clue didn't do what I'm shit. doing. That spare, that spare wheel didn't do much for me. My damage <laughs> really? is still 347 to 600. Yep. I mean, mine's 338, so... Well, even though last time we played, I did not... Um, I didn't get any damage points that entire Neither time. Neither did I. Yeah. Neither did I. But well, hey, you're you don't the, know what you're, you're doing. You're the noob. I, you're we're the both noob. a noob. I'm not a noob. You're the I, noob. I, I guess I am, yeah. I should have really spent the, the, this last six weeks learning this game to make sure that I knew every <laughs> tiny aspect of it. So that way, you know. Well, you, I, I appreciate <laughs> that the... that was my mistake. Yes. No, I appreciate the, um, the apology. Okay, good. I felt like I was uh, being Hopefully. held back last time. 100%. Okay, good. Well, hopefully everybody else can accept my apology as well. Uh, you're, and you can pull me since I always pull you. <laughs> um, I would totally pull you if I didn't yeah. just run out of gas. <laughs> you just ran out of gas? You got to be shitting me. You have got to be shitting me. How did you manage that? Because I started and there was only freaking 12 liters of fuel in this truck. Well, that's going to be a problem for you there, bud. It is going to be a problem for the both of us. I'm going to have to pull you all the way back to the fucking fuel depot again? Yes. Oh, that's good. <laughs> that's good. I mean, I always do it anyway, so, you know. Yeah. All right. What's, Put this, what's any different? Uh, down to auto here. Hang on. Let me go ahead and pull up a little bit here and park and brake. All righty. Let's go ahead and winch it up. Yep. Winch me. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. All right. I'm in neutral. Parking brake is off. All right. I'm all good. All right. I'm going to go ahead and uh, click this over into probably the second one there. And diff many, locks on. Uh, We're good. How many liters of fuel do you have left? I have 115 of 270. Oh, okay. Yeah. I also, I'm using a different truck than you. And I'm just this truck. Because like we did it last time at the end of the, the last video was we realized right. I was using 22 liters a minute. And you're only using 12. And we are both in the yeah. same like configuration. We both had all-wheel and diff lock. So whatever truck mm -hmm. this is, which I think is the C4360 or something. I don't know. I'm definitely wrong right. about that. Uh, spin tire's new. And um, I think this truck just uses more fuel. I think it's just less of fuel efficient than yours is. Yeah, probably. Yeah. All right. Also, that damage probably really doesn't help. No, it doesn't at all. I really wish they had a uh, fuel depot right next to this garage. Yeah. That'd be kind of cool. Mm -hmm. But it no. Can't but it wouldn't be a spin tires video lucky. if you didn't have to pull me somewhere. That's true. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. that's yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. Anytime. Anytime you need to pull somebody. And, oh, you know how... Call okay, me. so I had... Uh, well, I talked to you about that before. I was like, the acoustic panels in my room. Yes. The, the gap at the top, I couldn't take it anymore. So I am oh, you shifting it? all of them all the way back up to the top. <laughs> and I'm going to have to do that, that for the whole gap. back corner for the room. Yep. That little tiny gap. It was well, like an inch. Then, 
Yeah, well, and then I see originally I had my desk to where it was not, it wasn't set up right, like to where I can have a webcam or anything like that for doing um, streams. So now I had to pull the desk away from the wall. Oh, well, right. now I have to use a step ladder, and now the step ladder is too big <laughs> to get back in there without pulling Jesus. all that shit out. Yeah, it's a whole project in my room right now. <laughs> Good God. But I got three more boxes of them today. And Damn. usually they usually they come vacuum sealed. Yeah. And uh, these were not. They were all completely expanded. Oh, nice. What Which just you, black? Yep. If yeah. you ever if you ever get them and they're vacuum sealed, if you want don't want to wait like a week for them to expand, it usually only takes a couple days. You put them in a tub, uh, right? Put them in a tub of water with salt. No, I don't use no. I don't use salt on them. Oh, salt water. Take them to the ocean. I don't know. I mean, the beach is only an hour away. I'm not a professional YouTuber. I don't have that shit. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> but you can, you can, well, what, last time I did it, it just took forever for them to dry. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there it's foam. Yeah. I could imagine you soak foam in water. Yeah, what, were the, take a, what were the odds that you'd run out of gas and the fuck it'd be nighttime? Um, pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> pretty good. I mean, it is spin tires. That's true. This is what this is exactly what happens when we play spin tires. I run out of fuel, you pull me, and then night comes. Yep. At least the fuel is coming remember, up. Is the yeah? It's coming up here on the right. It's not this. No, it's it's on the left. It's not this one. It's the next one. The next left. You're yeah, right. the next left. Now I remember because you mm -hmm. ran out of fuel right here last time. Yep. Yep. Like a bitch. Yeah. Like a damn bitch. Well, you know. I'm a spin tires noob, so. Yep. I don't know I what think, I'm doing. I think my life would have been a lot easier if I would have used that 3M spray on the wall. Uh, but the only issue with that is doesn't that rip your paint off if you're trying to it pull does, it off? Yeah. But you also, can't be doing that. I'm using T pins, and those destroy the wall too. Yeah, but it, in a different sense, like it's just little tiny holes. Yeah. There's a lot of them though, because what is it, four pins per panel? Yes. This is our how many here. panels do you think I'm you have up there? A swing. Oh, quite a few. I have no idea how many. Yeah. It's going to be close to 100 when I'm done. Jesus. Maybe not 100. Maybe like 60 or 70. That's still a lot. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of them. Yeah. I need to do that. I need to, to do that. I just don't well, have it's an nice. office. I don't have to have the microphone on my face. Right. Yeah, yeah. Like even right now, I don't have to have it in my face. And then once I get the panels all finished it'll be even better yeah you could do like full no noise gate pretty much right yep that's the goal eventually to get yeah. to that level okay how we what, doing what, back there i'm doing great all right i'm doing fine i'm just i'm just steering the wheels yep doing fine how you doing well we're at 61 liters of 270 how do i switch camera angles again getting close uh clicking your left stick that's your um inside ah, view okay it's only been a couple days, but I totally forgot all the buttons. I might fucking run out of fuel myself on this one, dude. Uh, you really shouldn't. I'm at 57. I mean, we might be all right. It's we're we're getting pretty close. I mean, it's yeah. it's it's right here. We got a yep. little curve to the right after this turn, and then it's yep. right there. We should be all right. Yeah. I am just crawling in. Uh, yeah, just a little bit here. Oh, How we much got red. In a minute? Red on the fuel. 11 to 12 liters a minute. That's not bad. For what? Being in two in low two? Yep. In manual two with all wheel and diff lock? Yep. That's not bad. See, mine would use 22 liters a minute if I did that. Yeah. Well, you have the, Well, my damage isn't too bad either. It's a 347 to 600. Mine's less than yours, though. Still 338. Can be nice. I think it's just yeah. the truck. I think I just this truck is less fuel efficient than We yours. just had to play in hardcore mode. I asked you when we set this up, <laughs> hardcore or not. I was, you're like, let's do hardcore. I, like, I never do normal. I'm Jeff Raviano. Yep, I, I was know like, what, what are you, I'm bitch? A, I'm a spin tires pro. Yes, spin tires pro. <laughs> I've been playing spin tires since. We actually have played spin tires since its inception. <laughs> I know we have. Like, since it was uh, forever. Early access, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. We've been playing spin tires for a long time, but you know, Come I don't know on, what I'm doing. Come on, fuel station. You can make it. Have I got 42 liters? No, we're good. Yeah, if you we'll make it eventually. 42 liters in this little bit, we got a problem. Yep. Well, I'm going to get fuel first, and then I'll pull you yeah. through. 
That's fine. That way we don't have any issues. Slow your roll back there. <laughs> 231 liters refueled. All right. I'm going to start pulling you through here. All righty. You're close. So close. I'm going to turn my headlights off. Since we have lighting here, which is nice. Pull and you up I'm to good. There. Good. There we go. 270 liters. Fantastic. All right. Go ahead and release the winch. There we go. Awesome. All right. How much does yours hold? I hold 270 liters. Okay. Yeah, same. I'm going to get some okay. water, too. So, uh, making the trip back, picking up those other garage trailers. Yep. We just go out here to the left and then to the right and all that. I'm pretty sure one of these days we will see what modifications we can do to those trucks. One day. <laughs> one day. Not not anytime well, soon. Well, this should but be enough day. this time. But this I should would be, imagine. yes. Yes. It should be. Oh, I did not want to put a winch. I just winched myself. Twitch. What? <laughs> Great. I hit Y and thinking it was something else. Look at this thing. I'm really going to try to be fuel efficient on this trip. Oh, yeah. I'm going to really attempt it. Well, we'll swing back through on the way back. Last time at. Yes. Did we do that? Yeah, we no, did. No, we didn't. Oh, that's probably not on the way back. Out. Okay. And then I didn't really start getting into dangerous fuel levels until mm -hmm. uh, we had passed this place. Right. So we, we passed the fuel depot, and I was like, I think I'm all right. And then it started to go red, and then I barely had enough to make it to the, the garage. And then we ended. Yep. By the way, how so freaking cool is that, that we were able to just load back into the multiplayer game and start going again? I do like that God, a that's lot. that's so nice. Because before so we nice. used to just have to throw them in the trash and be like, well, yeah. we got to start all over again. That's why we used to just start playing with mods. It was like, what's the point? Yeah, because it was like, there's no point. It, either we're going to sit there for three to four hours attempting to complete, like, delivering the logs. Or mm -hmm. we're just going to play with mods and be able to play for however long and then just abandon it. Now it's like we can do all everything. We could play with mods and do the logs and quit and come back and Going down this that. way. Yep. Same road oh, yeah. that we did before. Yep. Good little lordy. Yes, well, the map sir. always looks much bigger than it is, so yep. that's the good news. If you feel like you can go faster than me and you want to pass, go right ahead. I'm trying to just be as fuel efficient as possible, so I'm baby in the throttle over here. Okay. So if you if you want to pass me, just let me know. I'll let you know. I'm pretty good right here for right now. I'm getting like a good five liters per minute. Three yeah, that's what I'm minute. trying to keep mine around to five liters a minute. You can't see it from the inside, though, unfortunately. Right. Well, hopefully it stays night forever. <laughs> I'm sure it will. It is spin tires where yep. it's it's night Big longer rock. than it is day. Damn, oh, that probably draft. would have ripped out the oil pan there. Oof. Side draft. I am getting that side draft. You got to get away that. from him, though. Get that side, that side draft. draft. Get off the side. <laughs> Slow him down. Are you in uh, manual or? No, oh, auto. Auto. So I can just creep Yeah. whenever I want to. So I creep. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Where are we at here? We're over here. Man. Let's go we'll straight. Make it yeah, eventually. I mean, we're f yeah, we're fine. We'll get there eventually. Mm -hmm. We'll get there when we get there, but you'll get tired of seeing this uh, terrain. I promise you that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they already are because we did mm -hmm. this last time. <laughs> Just doing it again. Wait, we got to do it. I mean, it has to be done. Yeah, it has to be done. There's nothing else we can do. Nope. I also, this this map is so interesting because you don't start with a garage. Like, that's that's a lot more yeah. challenging. It's way more challenging. You have because to make we can't the garage. Fix these, uh, we can't fix these trucks either unless we have a garage. So, right. whether we're going to do the logs or not, like, it's just that we've got to unlock this thing. Which means we have to drive these goddamn train cars. Yep. With, and their steel wheels and their top-heavy shenanigans. Oh, yeah. Back to the garages again. Did you see that uh, SpaceX wants to send people to the moon at the end of the year? Or there was For two what? Like, there were there were two people that ticket. 
well, it's like between 20 and 40 million dollars. Oh. You want to go, yeah, so there are going to be civilians, but I think they want to open it up to where they're like, hey, if NASA, if you have any astronauts that you want to send, oh. <laughs> we'll take them instead. Yeah. But yeah, no, these people are paying between 20 and 40. It's either. Wow. They said they, because what they said, they didn't ex like disclose how much it is. Right. Yeah. They just said that um, it's going to be as much as like a trip for a civilian to the International Space Station, which is between 20 and 40 million dollars. <laughs> oh, OK. Only. So civilians can actually take a trip to the International Space Station. If you have the money, apparently. Wow. So uh, GoFundMe, Code Zero, uh, going to the moon. I, uh, would you go, though? Like, think about that. Re like, really think about that. Would you go to the moon? <sighs> if I... That's a lot. I mean... It is, a, but if you were presented the opportunity, like, the... Yeah. the trip is paid for or you ran you uh got like a a prize or something where it's like you got you won a trip to the moon i mean you do have Could a you, you not do it uh, well you have a much higher chance of dying oh absolutely i mean something's gonna go could go wrong oh, horribly absolutely. i mean rocket yes. wise uh, uh, like, supply system whatever uh, absolutely the risk is insane it's but only the a week reward, it's a week trip to the moon exactly the reward if you make it back That'd be pretty well, incredible. That would be amazing. You went to the moon for a, where'd you, oh, where were you last week? Oh, just on the moon. Yep. But, like, but you wouldn't land the moon. You just orbit around the moon. I know, but still like that would be a story that you'd be able to tell no, for the rest absolutely. of your life. No, I agree with that. I'm just saying like, would you put your life in that much jeopardy? Yes. <laughs> to see the moon. <laughs> Yes. I mean, because if you blow up on the launch on 39A <laughs> on the way out, I mean, you're never going to see the moon. You didn't see anything, yeah. <laughs> you saw the inside of the Dragon well, capsule. I, you know, with all the risk, I would probably still say yes. I think the reward is worth the I risk. I think you're right. I think you, you'd you have to it's do it. It's a one-in-a-lifetime experience. Like, yep. Because if, if that does become mainstream, if that does become a thing that's more available to, you know, that... that average everyday person mm -hmm. we're it's not in our lifetime nope here's the field of rocks yeah Love it's it. fielded the field of hard rocks field of shit field of shit yeah damn but yeah no i think the reward is worth the risk i would totally do it yeah and what i mean can, can you vlog it <laughs> i'm sure you could i'm sure you I, could i mean i don't see why not <laughs> God, God, that's what's gonna happen you're going to get a YouTuber a gonna go that's going to go <laughs> space exit up. That's what's going to uh, happen eventually. That will happen. Yep. That will happen. I, live streaming. We're getting ready to blast off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. That would be hilarious. Well, so many things can go wrong. I mean, we there's not a lot of man like man trips. Hell, I, I would imagine, I would hope. Are you all right? You stuck? I I just I gotta go into manual here. Oh, get yeah, diff lock definitely. going. Um, you either can go with uh, like I I would imagine SpaceX will have to do an unmanned version first. You know, right? Man, like a test of here? it. You would think they would have to do that. I don't. It doesn't look like they plan to do that though. They're like, yeah, I'm we can do it. We can get it done. See, I don't know. That's a little sketch. I would want them to prove that they could do it and return it and without any issues because I wouldn't want to be the test. You know, I, I don't want to be involved in the test. Right. I would want them to prove that they could send even just an empty one on the same mission and have it land safely. And if they do it, then it's like, oh, OK, well, they've well, done it once. I'm sure eventually, they can do it again. eventually you just got to just go for it. That's what they're going to do. I mean, that's what NASA had to do eventually. But, you know, what's right. interesting is uh most of the people that believe that we didn't go to the moon, I'm still a 50-50 person on that. Um, I think there's evidence on both sides. Yeah, uh, me too. But as far as that goes, like, people who say that we can't get past the Van Allen belt, well, we're going to find out because <laughs> you're going to send two well, people to... to uh, but you know what's going to happen? The the conspiracy theory is will be like, theorists will say, oh, well, they're in on it. No wonder that they're, they have between 20 and $40 million. They're going to be part of the elite. Of course, they're going to lie and cover it up and blah, 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 blah. But well, I mean, what I'm wondering is who is going to do this? Who's going to pay that? Who has that money to spend and who's going to go? 
a lot of people out there that I don't even you wouldn't even know their name. Yeah, I guess. I don't know. They should make know. they should they should they should make it into a reality show. SpaceX the the real world SpaceX edition. The real world SpaceX. <laughs> I, we saw how many I saw that capsule. I don't know how many people it holds. We think like what five? Yeah, five strangers, five rich strangers in a small capsule for in a week. One capsule for, for one week. week. They're gonna hate each other. It's gonna be great. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to say goodbye to Earth and start getting real. <laughs> that would be. That would, I would watch that. I would watch that. Well, of course, I wouldn't watch, watch any it, of the but... other real worlds, but I'd oh. watch that. Yep. That'd Real world amazing. is the epitome of it's pretty much trash TV. It's finest. Oh, absolutely. It's a train wreck. You can't stop, you help but watch. Yeah, but, but I once mean, in a while, I do like to indulge in some trash TV. Who doesn't? That's just human nature. I mean, humans like watching trash. Like, just there's something about the drama <laughs> where you're just like, oh, I like this. I don't know why. I think of an intelligent species that's out there and just like watching <laughs> us and they're like, what the fuck? Real yeah, they world watch Seattle. What we watch. Yeah, they're like, what the fuck is this? God damn. They're like, yeah, we're not going to contact them. Yeah, let's just pass by. <laughs> let's just keep on going. Uh, that's true. Yeah, that is true. Oh, we're getting there now. I remember this. I think I see them. Path. Yeah, that's them down there. Mm -hmm. That's them down there over them hills. And I see your S10. The second S. There's two of them, right? Yeah. Yeah. Because one's mine, one's yours, and you probably see my, your Dakota. Because I have one, you have one. Yep. That's what it is. I haven't really gone over like seven liters a minute. Like, I've been just fucking I've got plenty of fuel. We can baby prop, in this thing. Yeah, we can. I don't know why you're doing that. We have a fuel depot right there on our right. Because I'm a noob. And I don't know anything about this game. <laughs> I don't have any time for this shit. <laughs> well, go around me. Pass me oh, up. Oh, I'm I'm going to. It's time to load up. Yeah, try to pit <laughs> me, bitch. Oh, look at that bird. <laughs> Did you see it? No. I guess I don't need my headlights on anymore. Did it beep, get scared beep, beep. coming out of the woods? Yeah, but it was like really well modeled. It was like a duck. It was like a duck. Just like a duck. It didn't give a fuck. I'm back up to it. Did you like that slide job? <laughs> no, you're way down there. Jesus. I'm baby in the throttle. I don't blame you. I've ran out of gas two times in mm -hmm. this session. And you haven't once. I'm clearly doing something wrong. Well. All right. I wasn't parking brake. You damn noob. Got the trailer. Park and break off. Back to the world of Steelies. Son of a bitch. Steely Dan. <laughs> I'm going to name this trailer Steely Dan. What in the hell? There Interaction we go. disabled, it said. Yeah, it. the little ghost icon was like a little tiny baby miniature trailer. It wasn't anywhere near the size of that one. It yeah, just looked no, ridiculous. Yeah, yours, yep, yours is the same way. It and looks ridiculous. Attached to it, <laughs> these fucking cabooses that are garbage. Classic Russia. We're like, use these cabooses. Mm-hmm. Okay, so advanced mode. Okay. Scare all the birds away. There we go. There you go. Let's do it. Yep, let's do it. I'm swing by, get some fuel, and I'm I'm balls the wall in it back. 